Welcome to the Learning Music Hub Musical Instruments. Discover the different devices for producing musical sounds whether it can be an stringed, wind, brass, or a percussive instrument. In Lesson 52, we will discover how playing musical instruments shapes the brain. If you want to learn about musical instruments quickly, you may always refer to this video and follow on all of our lessons. As you listen to music, multiple areas of your brain become active and engaged, or even change your mood. But don't you know that playing a musical instrument gives you more fully body brain, a multi-sensory workout? It can also strengthen memory, help us pay attention, and perhaps even improve reading ability as you actually play an instrument. In this video, you will find out how playing musical instruments shapes your brain. We will highlight how various brain functions, including hearing, sight, movement, and social. In the recent decades, neuroscience and researchers discovered that actively playing a musical instrument, particularly at a young age, has a great advantage in motor skills than by just merely a listener which is different, or perhaps a smaller effect. This is much the same as the way that play sports will improve your physical condition more than simply watching sports. Therefore, the focusing power of music could be amplified by actual playing. We propose that the differences observed between the brains of musicians and the non-musicians can be attributed to neuroplastic adaptations responding to the challenging demands of musical practice. Also, in this video, we explore research on learning and music to help us understand why music promotes brain development and how music can be central part of our lives. We can only define music in general way, as a form of communication through sound. Unlike speech, however, music is not generally considered semantic. This means that music does not use words to explain things. Think how difficult it would be to say something relatively simple like, your right shoe is untied, using only melody and rhythm. At the same time, Music can convey profound emotions that would be difficult to describe in words. In addition to music being an art form, any form of communication is part musical and can be said to have musicality. I can say it's abstract and it's intangible. Apparently, let's see the mood of both music listener only and a musical instrument player. As they hear the music, it increases the blood flow to brain regions that generate and control emotions. The limbic system, which is involved in processing emotions, and controlling memory lights up when our ears perceive music. Do you know that helping to regulate your mood is one of the important functions of your hormone? But what is a hormone? A hormone is one of the many substances made by glands in our body. They travel through the bloodstream acting as a messenger and playing a part in many bodily processes. 
Yes, there are certain hormones that are known to help promote positive feelings, including happiness and pleasure. These happy hormones include number 1. Dopamine. This is also known as the feel-good hormone. This is a neurotransmitter that's an important part of your brain's reward system. It's associated with pleasurable sensations along with learning, memory, and more. Number two, serotonin. This hormone and neurotransmitter helps regulate your mood as well as your sleep, appetite, digestion, learning ability, and memory. Number 3. Oxytocin Often called the love hormone. Oxytocin is essential for childbirth, breastfeeding, and strong parent-child bonding. It can also help promote trust, empathy, and bonding in relationships. Levels generally increase with physical affection. Number 4. Endorphins. These hormones are your body's natural pain reliever, which your body produces in response to stress or discomfort. Levels may also increase when you engage in reward-producing activities such as eating, working out, and others. So, music can do something to help produce more of these natural mood boosters. Music can give more than one of your happy hormones a boost. Listening to classical music and playing musical instrument can increase dopamine production in your brain. Music is an intangible reward or an abstract reward as opposed to tangible reward like your favorite food. Music triggers and rushes the release of chemical called dopamine in part of the brain called the striatum. One of the things that happens when music enters our brains is the triggering of pleasure centers that release dopamine, a neurotransmitter that makes you feel happy. This response is so quick, the brain can even anticipate the most pleasurable peaks in familiar music and prime itself with an early dopamine rush. And if you enjoy it, that may help put you in a good mood. This positive change in your mood can increase serotonin production. It may also significantly increase your oxytocin levels as you will have a feeling of more elated and energetic after playing an instrument. You may also experience an endorphin release while performing music. Let's dissect the musician's brain. Playing an instrument impacts brain function and human behavior, including by reducing stress, pain, and symptoms of depression, as well as improving cognitive and motor skills, spatial temporal learning, and neurogenesis, which is the brain's ability to produce neurons. A neuron is a cell in a nervous system whose function is to receive and transmit information. There are 100 billions of neurons in our body. Playing an instrument also has known to increase cognitive ability, which sometimes referred to as the general intelligence, through enhanced neuronal communication between the left and right hemispheres of the brain, resulting in positive effects on learning, memory, fine motor skills, 
verbal reasoning, and nonverbal reasoning, resulting in an overall more capable brain to apply in a variety of diverse settings. If you examine the brain of a piano player, you'll find that the region of the brain that controls finger movements is enlarged. Musical instrument players have significantly more gray matter volume in both sensory motor cortex and the occipital lobes. In fact, musicians have significantly more gray matter in several brain regions. Experiments confirm that the brain really changes in response to music training. So, it's reasonable to think that the brain develops differently in response to music training and discipline. Playing an instrument involves the interconnectedness between the motor, sensory, auditory, visual, and emotional components of the central and peripheral nervous systems. This full brain mental workout involves artistic and aesthetic aspects of learning that is a unique characteristic of playing an instrument that an individual cannot stimulate by any other activity, even at athletics. The combination of linguistic and mathematical precision in the left hemisphere is trained to work in coordination with the creative and novel functions in the right hemisphere. This will increase activity in the corpus callosum, allowing messages to get across the brain faster and through more diverse routes. The improved communication between hemispheres is then translated to a musician's enriched ability to solve problems more effectively and creatively in academic and social settings. Let's see some important things that happen in the brain when we play music. Number 1. Auditory the auditory system processes sound more effectively after musical training. People can detect smaller differences in frequency, the number of sound waves per second, making both speech and music easier to hear. From our ear to our brain, the auditory system connects our ear to our brain to process sound. When we hear something, our ears receive it in the form of vibrations that it converts into a neural signal. That signal is then sent to a brain stem up to the thalamus at the center of the brain and outward to its final destination, the primary auditory cortex located near the sides of the brain. Number 2. Motor Brain areas that control instrument-related muscles and body parts such as fingers, the mouth, etc. grow in size. More neurons in the brain are devoted into fine-tuning muscle movement in these areas. Studies show that better musical ability is related to the higher reading scores, suggesting a link between how well we hear music and how well we can map speech sounds to letters. Number 3. Socio-emotional awareness Playing music together can enhance socio-emotional awareness, which is the ability to identify, manage, and express emotions constructively. A good example of this is that very young children are more likely to interact positively with people they play music with. The research 
So, how did we know this? Brain scanning technologies have permitted neuroscientists to observe the activity of living brains. And the results are clear. Musicians are different. Several randomized studies and experiments show that neurophysiological distinction is strained when a child actively learns to play an instrument. Their brains learn to hear and interpret sounds unique to the experience of playing music that is not trained by such listening to it. Studies also found that playing musical instrument is equivalent of a fully body workout for the brain. Flashing forward into a present day, neuroscience technology such as fMRI, PET scanners, and MRI imaging have greatly increased our ability to understand the effect of music on the brain. And they can measure the neural plasticity with these special brain imaging techniques. Neural plasticity is the process of changing the brain through our experiences. Because the brain is easily shaped, like plastic, just like our muscles, our brain gets stronger when we exercise it. In our conclusion, music is a powerful stimulator of the brain. As proven in many experiments, playing an instrument will really enhance the development of cognitive skills. So, if we want to provide yourselves and your children with brainy enrichment activities, playing a musical instrument is just one of many. Take advantage of this best and free music app only here in YouTube. Learning Music Hub, Musical Instrument. An animated approach, made clear and easy to understand. You can possess all these music lessons. Just click like, subscribe, and click on the bell button so that you can always get updated with all of our great music lessons that's coming in your way. Thank you.